follow me. Come yeah, the on. jacket ain't the best fit on her, but if it does keep me warm, bro, yeah, I'll take it. Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. Hmm. Hey. You want a hug? Cause I, I kinda a need hug. a hug. Okay, well, I owe you one for later then. You might not know what's coming though, but I could just sneak up on you when you're not expecting it. Yep. My dad's never hit me before. Yeah, that wasn't intentional. Even when I was really bad. Your dad didn't he want didn't to. didn't want to do it, Sarah. Carver made him. He's the bad guy. Yeah. Not your dad. So, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess so. Carver hit me super hard, because it still hurts like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it looked like it. Well, thanks for trying to help. I don't know why people have to be so mean. Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. That's a good thing, dear. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Hmm. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep, no problem, Davia. Okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Oh, and just so you know, Bill yelled at me this morning for what you were doing last night. I'm not mad, but please, please just listen to me today. I'm on, like, the thinnest ice with that guy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Okay. okay Man, so a lot of cinematics. Bags, right? In these Just episodes, them, that's only the second the game. Basket. Simple. Okay. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Okay. Got it. Hey, so is she gonna be okay? No. Cause what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. I'll take, I'll take care, care of her. her. You don't have to worry. Good, good. Because I'm awful at that stuff. Look, mm -hmm. Bill's had it out for me ever since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. That was awkward. I won't do that again. <laughs> I'm gonna go work now. Sounds good, bro. Do your own work, bro. Nah, 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 nah. We're taking care of her, but she's got, she got, she got to learn. I don't, I don't like what Carver is doing, or Bill. I'm gonna call him Carver. I think that's way cooler than Bill. But gotta do our work around here, and then I can just take care of her. You know? Oh shit! Oh no! What? What did you do? These are only half done. Are those live branches? Clementine, I asked you to help her. Just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. But like, okay, if I helped her, what would have happened to me? Reggie. Yeah, Bill. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bill, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy... I just have... I have one shut arm. Shut up, so shut up. Shut the fuck up. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. Bill, please, just... Sounds just... like you were about to give me an excuse when I asked for an explanation. It was my fault. It was my fault. No, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. Didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? I don't care, man. Like, no offense, okay. dude. Like, like uh, everyone's gotta do the part. wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about.
Thanks for the help, girls. Like, What's wrong, Sarah? What if I did help her? Like, my work wouldn't be done. You know? Are you okay? Oh. I gave no, you no, plenty no, of chances. Please, Bill. No, 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 Weakness, incompetence, it puts us all at risk, Bro, and it won't be no. tolerated. You think about that the next time you're asked to do something. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Dude, bro, oh, no. <sighs> Poor guy, bro. Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That jacket looks real nice. I don't know what Tavia's talking about. What's wrong? Just Clem? You all right? Harvard just killed Reggie. Reggie. Reggie's dead. What? What are you talking about? Carver killed him. He pushed him off the roof. Maybe... Maybe it was just an accident. Really? An accident? Listen to me. Take this stuff out to those guys and come straight back. I feel like, like, just we're literally watching safe, a movie in okay? a video game. Now ain't the time to be calling attention to it's yourself. It's crazy, like, the, like, I don't think there was ever that I much... to go find out what happened. Like, cinematic, like, scenery like this in the first game. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails. All right. Go on. Hey, Poor that ain't Reggie, your bro. concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Laborer, fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get your fucking hands off you me. You ain't gonna force me to do this bullshit. I said, get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tell on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, Stop this fighting, is bro. a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Stop fighting. I want to, Clem, but this son of a bitch keeps. I just want to get the work done. And oh no! Shit! Fuck! Grab something. Oh, dude, this is terrible. Man, a piece of wood? I mean, that's, that's better than nothing. I'm clicking everything. Get in there. Will they escape? Will they escape? I am, I am, I am. What, what the heck? Why did it stop before? <laughs> nice. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Let's get that ladder on them. Now they can't come through the door. Uh, yep, give him that. Big screwdriver. Come on, come on, come on. Bang. Nice. Get up. Get out of there. Come on. Make me save your ass. Jesus. Oh, thank God you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You mm. get back inside right I hate this guy now. more than Carver, bro. Sure they got shit for you to do in there. 
Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? All right. Bro, I'm loving... Oh. Me. Yep. Luke. Perfect. Yes. I knew he wouldn't give up on us, man. Man, but the hell out of me. I think you drew blood. Come all this way. This is this is the welcome I get. A good hug. A good hug. A good I was hug. worried. We all were. No, it's good to see you too, kid. All right. Listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, that's the first chance I got to talk to somebody. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards. Watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. He said he hopes it passes us. Yeah, I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to. To get y'all free, mm. but I haven't been able to find anything yet. Yo, I'm gonna ask him if he's feeling okay. He he looks like he's. Are you feeling okay? Yeah. Uh, no, I mean, uh, yeah, yes. Sorry, I, I just could use some sleep. You know, hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Okay, don't worry about me. It seems right. dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but well, we're in it now. That's what right. we got. Yep. We just. I just need a plan. You know, a way to get you and, and everyone. No way you pass out, bro, from Luke. like losing a little bit of sleep. Oh, sorry, sorry. Shit. He's definitely bit. He's Rachel, definitely bit. I, I know he's bit, dude. Listen, Clem, I need you to meet me here tomorrow about this time. Because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Okay, sounds good. We ain't good. gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. I'll get you okay. one. Okay, I'll get you one. Thanks, Clem. I'm so glad I can count on you. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Go on, get out of here. The hell were you doing? Huh? Hiding from walkers? I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. So get on up there, now. Rebecca. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Get in here. Hmm. He just keeps a dead body. Alvin. Alvin. No. He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Why, Why are you doing this? Yeah, bro. Me and him, we got history. Understand? A couple things we had to get worked out. I wouldn't be so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. It's easy to let depression sink in during times like this. But he was weak, 
And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. He didn't, he didn't deserve yeah, that. Yeah, he did not deserve Even if he that. messed up, he didn't deserve to die. Oh, he certainly did. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? Well, I wish no. it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock. I'm not like to you. To keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye, kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way, the way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing. If I got anyone to hand all this off to. What if it's not yours? But I ain't worried about that anymore. What if it's not yours? Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. Wow. All right, now. Well, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at mm. when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. Okay. Victor's Comics. Because we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is going to do next. So you want to ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Because this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just got to figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. Hmm. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous. Luke's Henry, got a plan. Do not speak to me like that. Maybe Luke could help us. He's outside. He wants a radio to help keep an eye on the guards. Thank you. That's the plan I vote for. You know about Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he talked to you. If okay, Luke cool. So he did tell to everyone else. We Sick. Can use that to pick a good time to escape. I thought like I just messed up just now telling them and then the, one of them's gonna rat on us with Luke's plan. There was plan. a girl back at Crawford that used church bells to send walkers all over the city. We just need something really loud. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. There are a few along the controls road. Are I saw the controls. They're in Carver's office. She's right. It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that'll turn them on. How do you know that? I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. We just gotta get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Penny. No, mm. that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. We should get the radio to Luke. Yeah. It doesn't hurt to have more information. I agree. Fine, fine. We can do that. But the herd is still what's going to get us out of here. Maybe Luke can tell us where it's hitting from. 
Okay, so we get that turd radio. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually, I do it all the time. Hmm. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? Word. You cover yourself in their smell. Rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. Okay. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me. I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure I've done you're it too. covered. I've done it too. What? It's Ooh. how we got out of the marsh house. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right. What are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Okay. Where the hell did she come from? We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. Now or never. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Don't let go. I got you. Go and grab it. Thank you, buddy. Try to hurry, all right? I don't think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you not in your bunk, we're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab right, something. Right. Uh, uh. <sighs> yep, grab that. We're in trouble. Trying to see if there's oh the yeah, see like am I gonna go no, there? Not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking up. So you're not sure? What about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope they pass by us. God yeah. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does. We thought the same thing last time. We learned a lot from mm. last time. Is it enough though? Thinking guys, we'll I don't out. know what else to do. I feel like we're gonna get caught right here. Yeah. Like look at him, he's just standing right there. Okay, so he's Can't go past here. Nope. Nope. All right. Can't go past there. Mm. Okay, dude. I actually have no idea where I should go. So we already peeked there. I like one thing in this game. 
is like when you already like have an option to like select right like like you know we were able to look into this window in the first game they would give it to you again but now it's like when you click an option like you can't anymore i love that so much man that is a big splat <sighs> Hey, can we sneak around back here? Yeah. Take a look, shall we? Oh, yeah. This is where we get into, ladies and gentlemen. They got, they got someone guarding everything. It's crazy about Reggie, huh? Yeah. You think Bill... Go on. Nah, it's just... I was wondering if you thought Bill maybe... Spit it out, oh, Hank. Oh, I, th I thought... I don't think Bill was gonna let him back in. Huh. You don't? I thought she no. was gonna climb over herself. Do you? I don't know. Like, I wonder what happens if, like, you're in these moments and you really gotta sneeze. Like, do you just hold it in or, or, or like, like, what do you do? Like, a jet, like, a sneeze is like, you know, I'll show it now. That's what they do. Get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. I know what you mean. You figure we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. So what are you doing tomorrow? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. Is that why you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, oh. the new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm grab looking that. at it now. Let's grab that. We have what we need. Jesus, really? We repurposed a lot of shit to get this place built. I can't say for sure if we wait, even wait, had the wait. materials before we started expanding. I don't know about you, but it seems like we are really wait. shouldn't be doing this yet. Should we just wait until we need more space to make no, more space? No, 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 take it. She's not looking at I don't know, Hank. Bill's got a plan. Look, let's Dude. see we call it for now. We'll talk later. All right, talk to you later. Yep. No. Later. Out. Out. Okay, now she's not looking. Here we go. Let's hop on. Why is she not gonna see you, bro? You can't be smoking back <gasps> here. Vince, come on. Come on. Don't come give on, me that. If Bill smells a whiff of smoke back here, oh my he'll God, flip. This guy. What are you thinking? You know what? I'm just gonna tell him. I'm not letting someone else get blamed for this. That's bullshit. Vince. Vince, come on. Vince. Perfect. Man, that couldn't happen earlier. You get him? Okay, nice. jump down. I got you. All right, sit. We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well, got him. Got him. Everybody, stay where you are. No need drawing suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Hmm. Thanks. Thanks. Yep. Anyway, get some rest. I thought about Duck today, about his dumb little face. First things that come to mind are always the dumb things he was doing. Kid was always running in circles. Every damn place he went, he'd just run. He couldn't stop him. Makes it harder to remember he was a good boy. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. Hmm.
No one knows the walkies, right? All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we. Yep. 